Okay, now let's learn how to extend our React Native application. Okay, now go into your Node project. In this case, it's our restaurant app. And on Google search for Ignite React Native. Since our app is made with this, uh, how do I say, seed. And you should install this if you don't have already. And this is installing of our of the Ignite component. Okay, what we should do next is create a container. So in this case, we will create a new page in our menu. This is about us. Okay, so let's create a. We need to create a container. Container. So create this. Copy this command. And just paste it and change it to about us. Okay, now the new container is created. These are the files that are created. And open the code inside Atom or some editor that you prefer. So in containers, now we have about us container. So this is the content. You can change it about us container. I'll just add some. Okay. Okay, the container is created, but it's not at in our menu. So what we need to do is first to declare it in the navigation, and this is to the to the finest route. Okay, so first we need to import. I will just copy this import about us from containers about us. Okay, our uh, container is imported, but we need to declare it. So I'll declare it here. I will say about us. And this is the component about us, sorry. Title will use about us. This is the title that appears on the bar. Okay, our scene is created, but it's not at yet in the navigate in the view itself. So to add it, we need to go inside uh, containers, and the same the navigation is like another contain another container. So we need to find it here, and that's it. Drawable content. Okay, so we need to create an action that handle press that handle the press on the button that we will have the the line there. So I will copy this handle press about us so this toggle travel this to hide the role and navigation actions this is will be about us okay now we should define it here so this is the actual button that appears this is the icon in this case i will use the old one the name will be about us and I'll press use this function that we the new function that we created. Okay, that's all. Now we should run uh, the the app, and we will do do this by React Native run iOS, and we should see the new component, the new uh, container that that we created. Okay, the app starts, but it needs to load all the files. Okay, so yes, here it is. This is our new component. And that's it. Thank you.